hello guys uh, welcome once again today I will show you how you can upload your CSV file to your database with the help of a Java program so first of all question arises is what is a CSV file a CSV file looks like this which opens in excel sheet and the full form of csv file is comma separated value files so as the name suggests in csv file the values are separated by comma as you can see in here so these values are separated by comma so in many application like in some data logging system or some sensors they provide their data in the form of csv file so these csv file we can directly upload to the database and we can analyze through uh, our java program so in this csv file i have 11 or i would say 10 uh, values which are separated by comma 1 2 3 and like this these are 10 different values which are separated by comma and this is a sensor data which collects the data on the basis of time so this is the real time data of the project I am working on and I want to upload this data and analyze the, this data in Java so first of all what I will do is I will go to my database and I will make a table in my database called timing data you can name your see your database table whatever you want and what I have done is I have made those 11 columns for those 11 values of data so you just have to make a table and you have to make the number of columns which your data or csv file contains so my data contains serial number item id function state full date what is the day month year hour minute second and millisecond so i made my table in the database and now i will go to my code and i will show you how i can make it so first of all what I will do is I have to provide the path of this file to convert into my database so what I have done is I have taken a attach button and which when I click opens the j file chooser so the code of this attach button you already know i have already uh, have uh, teach that thing in the last video and this attach button writes or pastes 
the length in this text field so this code I will not write because you know this code and I will go ahead after this code so in addition I have also taken a table in which I will show my CSV data after loading into the database and my CSV table name is doc table and I have taken a upload CSV button in order to upload the CSV file and I have made the update table function for or method for this table so it will be updated automatically this I also also I have already told you in previous videos so I didn't, don't need to tell you now what you have to do in upload table is write this code so whenever your data is loaded it instantly shows this data so what I have made is I have made this update table function and I have written this code into the upload table function this also you know the main thing and the main meat of this tutorial is the upload CSV button which I have already taken and I will go to its event action and action perform and this is empty right now so in this I will write the code for uploading my CSV so I think the time for this tutorial is over in the next tutorial I will show you how you can upload the CSV file with the help of this code so please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now